looks like we are currently at at the game one here between Meister and, and Kirby Kid. 492, by the way. But here we go. Game one of Winner's Finals, man. Uh, it's all about can Kirby Kid find a way to finally, finally, finally take a set off Meister, man. It's 6-0 in Meister's favor. Hey, man, but there's one person that's dropped less games in this tournament, and that's Kirby Kid. He's only dropped one game this entire bracket. 512 competitors taking down some insane names thus far. We can't get over it, man. Like Suarez and... Sam Sora and Aaron and Sonics, they all fell down to Kirby Kid. Let's see if he can. Oh, no, it's, he's having a really hard time here against Meister. That could be a yeah. wrap. Yeah. Oh, what? No. <laughs> this deck recovery is so insane sometimes, man. It's crazy when you see like a heavy character, right? Like second heaviest character in the game, and they have a recovery where they can go from like literally the bottom corner of the map all the way to the ledge. I mean, it's, it's, it's crazy. It's crazy to think about. Oh, that's a wrap. Yeah. See ya. Yeah, that's also crazy. Okay, oh, there we go. Great grab right there. Mm -hmm. Putting on about 20%. Oh, now that's tough. The juggle. Yeah. Juggle situation it continues, man. Do not be above Meister. This is so hard, dude. Being a heavy against... Oh, my God. The, the awareness from Kirby can just throw that out there. Now it's an even game. Oh, man, the boomerang effect <laughs> coming around. Oh. oh, okay, but there we go. Meister's going to answer back with a strong back air. Oh, my God, Kirby Kid. Yeah, what well, was once a two-stock game is no longer that. And now Meister, once again, reclaiming the lead. But still, one good hit away. Oh, my God. Oh, wow, yeah, wasn't able to close that stock out. But that certainly was a strong position for Kirby Kid. Going to be able to use that crown to get Meister off the ledge as well. And, oh, my <laughs> God, it's an even game. <laughs> Game and watch, dude. He's so light, and that up air has so much knockback. And now we're at one stock apiece, 20% difference. That's nothing to K rule. Oh my god, that grab, dude. <laughs> Kirby Kid missed the grab first, and then Meister just turned around, took the smallest of steps towards Kirby Kid, and was able to grab him. And now putting on 73% so far. This is bad. Yeah, bad news bears right here. We got him on the ledge against. No way, there's no way, there's no way, there's no way, there's no way. <laughs> yes, there's yes, not way. Fair. It's not fair, dude. <laughs> I felt, Yo, he, that, pain. I felt he, that pain before. He brought he brought him the Arby's and pulled out his chair for him so he could sit down. <laughs> I, I hate it, dude. I hate it in my heart. Meister's done that to me, and I feel that pain just watching that. Yeah, that uh, is, that yeah, is definitely that's, tough. That is a crazy game one going in Meister's favor, but man, Kirby could show him signs of life. Meanwhile, in the other end of top eight, man, and losers, we have two game fives for seventh place here. 8 Man and Chag are 2-2. Two, two. Aaron and Mr. E are 2-2. Two, two. This is crazy, man. This tournament is heated. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man. Everything coming down to the wire. Uh, so far, the only game, the uh, only set that ended up going only uh, four games is Sonic vs. Kirby. This is kind of reminiscent from last week as well, where both games we had on stream were actually game five sets, except for like, and then like one stream and the losers round top. Uh, lose around one top eight was like a 3 0, maybe. I don't know. It's it's just, man, this is where the best of the best is. Everybody's going right down to the wire, man. It's just strong competition. Yeah, there's a there's a lot of heart in this tournament, and nobody wants to lose. And that's what you see in like the losers round one of top eight, the seven place matches here. Like, that, those are elimination matches. Everyone knows what is at stake and what's on the line. Both sets have been going upwards of 28 minutes, and. Mm -hmm. Uh, both of them are waiting to go into their following opponents. I believe Chag and 8-Bit Man goes into Shiny Mark, and then Aaron and Mr. E goes into Sonics. So we got ways to go. Mm -hmm. For sure, for sure. And man, yeah, dude. I keep clicking on them just to see, like, hey, maybe it'll update after I click on it. But nah, these, these guys are definitely going down to the wire. It's actually insane. Aaron's actually going Pyramithra uh, against Mr. E's Lucina. So that's interesting. Oh, yeah. I think that's the end of the set, actually. I think Aaron actually got that in a 3-2 fashion. So, uh, moving on to the losers' quarters match against Sonics, that should be interesting. Ooh. Yeah, that'll definitely be a tough one. I think uh, I think Sonics has the advantage in that matchup. I'm gonna take a quick check right here as we wait for game two to get started. Let's see here, Sonics taking on Aaron. Bam. Uh, okay, so. Uh, between Sonics and Aaron, they've played 10 sets, and it's 6-4 in Sonics' favor. So it's definitely doable for Aaron, but Sonics does have a little bit of a lead on that. Uh, 
All right. Well, anyway, still winning on game two. Probably making some uh, some tough choices here. Kirby Kid recognizes where he's at. Um, I mean, loser here is guaranteed at least third. Uh, winner goes on to guaranteed second. Um, so, I mean, you know, Kirby Kid, I think, I don't know how often he's made a winner's finals. I think he's gone to winner's finals one other time. So he probably wants to, you know, make the big splash, get the grands for the first time here. And, you know, he's just trying to make sure he picks the right stage. That game one was pretty strong between both of them. And, uh... You know, it's just, uh, he, he wants to get there, man. He wants to win one. Yeah, the advantage was solidly in Game & Watch is power for a very large portion of that game. But the punish game that K. Rule has, if you're, if, you're, if you're sleeping, man, it can get really close. Mm -hmm. All right, looks like we're going to be going to Smashville right back to Smashville, it seems. And you know what? I think this is a good pick. I mean, yes, Meister did win, but, like, Kirby Kid got a couple explosive stocks. And uh, just kind of got caught in a bad situation on the final stock there that, you know, Mr. Game & Watch and Meister just really took advantage of. Yeah, so slowly but surely we'll be stepping into game two. Uh, I think they're taking their time here with the stages. I think, you know, we, we solidified. We're going to go to X Smashville. Same characters, same stage. And yeah, game two. Let's see what Kirby Kid can do. All right, well, going right to that ledge, just waiting for... Uh, for something there, oh my god, just straight up for 32. What a start. That was so strange. Ooh, the oh. parry on dude. Huge parry. Oh my god, that's 62%, man. It was one small opening from Meister, but one lot giant leap for Game & Watch. Jeez. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Straight out of NASA right there, they're going to put him in the blast zone. <laughs> and we got a huge lead for Meister. I mean, I think that's what SSG is for, right? Space Station Gaming? Right. <laughs> Yeah, I guess it definitely worked out a lot better than I thought. But here we go, man. Another grab into another 38%. 52. Oh, my God. It just doesn't stop. This is huge, dude. He, he's trying to go to Grands already. Yeah, dude. He just wants out of this. Oh, that's a tough spot to be in. Going to be able to make it back to stage. But the down smash puts him right back off. Yeah, man. Applying all of this pressure. Even the ready for the crown as well. K what does K. Rool have in this matchup? Well, apparently, they're not the belly either, man. Oh, my oh God. great tech. What, dude? What's going on? The armor doesn't even matter. 68% on Game & Watch. How does Kirby could get out of this, dude? I can see why he might have wanted to try another character. You, you, you mentioned he tried Min Min before in one of their past sets. Oh, dude, he threw out the hammer at least once. I mean, we're not going to see it connect, but that's when you know Meister definitely feels like he's in control of a match. He throws out that hammer, but oh my god, that big down smash. Going to be able to find a way to take out that first stock. So I'd be down for like a nine breaking a belly. That'd be so funny. <laughs> oh, actually, I, yeah, I'm, I'm with you. <laughs> that'd be pretty good. Okay, so here a couple we are, man. Uh, Good throw. And actually, Kirby Kid getting a little bit of momentum here. Has a chance to bring it to the last stock. Yeah, especially with uh, the weight uh, value that oh, K. Rule has. Um, it's really not over till it says game. Yeah, that's a lot of shield damage, too. Let's see if he can apply a ledge trap. Not going to get it there from the platform, but uh, it's a little bit spaced out. I mean, he does cover a lot of space with it, but still, this is, he's kind of bleeding right now. He's kind of suffering. Right. Oh, tried to go in for that back air, but Meister was ready for it. Throwing out a hitbox on this. Oh, and that bomb's going to connect at his tippy toe. Oh, wait, up here? Stall? Oh, what a recovery, though. <laughs> Lands right on the other side of the stage, throws out the crown immediately. But man, Meister just continues Ooh. to put on this pressure. Is that oh? it? No. <laughs> what was that angle? He still has room to up air, too. That's crazy. He knows his character so well. Mm hmm. Uh, nope. Great. Okay, I can use that belly. There. Oh, my God. 190. That okay, there we go. That has to be it, yeah. <laughs> I was like, is Meister just going to continue to put on damage so he kills him with up me? <laughs> yeah, oh, my really God. You're easy yeah. to replay from Meister, man. Getting the forward air off of the side on the second stock. And here, losing his stock to the down smash, but not going to stick around for too long as he suffers the forward air at high percent. Uh, Meister going up 2-0. This is looking really unbearable. <laughs> it's actually kind of funny because on the, on the one uh, up special, from Meister, uh, K. Rule's forward tilt actually clanged with the, uh, the the people on the trampoline, and then Meister actually hit him with the actual upwards momentum. That was actually kind of funny. No, I'm, I'm with you, man. Uh, so yeah, 2-0 advantage. You gotta wonder what stage we're gonna go to. 
uh, if he's just going to run it back because this is seeming like a really, really tough matchup. But, I mean, obviously, Meister number two online, number six offline, one of the best players in the world, period. And, uh, honestly, <laughs> uh, it, it is a, such a mountain to climb if you're Kirby Kid. Oh, yeah, this is definitely tough. Um, you said it earlier, man. Game & Watch just kind of tears up big-bodied characters, and Meister is the best example you will see put that into motion. And that game, too, was definitely rough. I mean, Kirby Kid was making a, a decent bit of a run at the end, but, man, it's just it's so tough when you're taking, like, 90% because he, he found, like, a grab or, or a parry like we saw in the beginning. Jeez. Yep. All right, here we go, man. Going into the next game. Same stage, same characters. Uh, uh, <laughs> and, yeah, let's get back right into it. Let's see if he can make any necessary adaptations. All right. Ooh. Yeah, to trying to put on some good damage. Okay, there we go. Getting a forward air into a dash attack. Getting some decent damage. Uh, still a little bit behind. That was kind of a weird interaction there, but it is what it is. Oh, okay. Meister trying to exert his will here and finally looks like he's getting that opening. All right, here comes the ledge trap. Uh, the bacon. Oh, goodbye. Oh, my God. Yeah, the down smash. Going to get the berry hitbox as well. That's unfortunate. Yeah, K. Roll being a huge body as he is, man. That down smash is going to get the right hitbox to just ground him more frequently. And clipping him a little bit more. Here come the combo starters, man. The neutral air is so deadly against K. Roll. Sure. Oh, the back air sticking his arm out is actually going to get him caught up in the uh, the up air from Game of Watch. Very unfortunate position, but there we go. <laughs> going to send one of the, uh, the pieces of meat right back. Yeah, trying to land. Here comes the lead trap from Kirby Kid, man. K. Oh. Rule not going to get it there, but the dash attack will and put him off stage. This is still very hard to do for uh, Kirby Kid, though. For sure, for sure. But right now, man, Meister is not necessarily, uh, you know, in the clear because, I mean, we got that half rage on K. Rule so far. And we've seen what Kirby Kid can do with a little bit of rage. And especially when he finds his own opening with K. Rule, man. He gets uh, some good damage in there. Uh, potentially gets a stock. Oh, my God. That's a bad trade. <laughs> but Kirby Kid will take it. Yeah, terrible trade for Meister. Uh, giving Kirby Kid a one stock chance here to make it count. All right, so uh, both these players continue uh, going to try and find their their ways in to uh, to get their damage in, get their combos. Yeah, this is uh, this is still even, man. This is still like a bad trade for Meister earlier. Uh, so the Kirby kid is getting chipped away on, and this is looking like a 3-0 unless he makes some plays. Can he land? Mm -hmm. No okay. way he gave up. Oh. oh my god, this is a chance here. Uh, Rage K rule, gonna throw the crown, trying to get a setup. And now, uh, honestly, Kirby Kid, really good chance here. Can he mm -hmm. ground him? Can he like, down throw him, down tilt him? Let's see. That's a wrap. Yep. <laughs> oh my god, yep, that up smash, man, it is absolutely dangerous, especially when Meister throws it out. I feel like there's a lot of times, like we saw this last week too, when Meister would charge like the third up smash, people would just run in to try and challenge it and lose stocks over it. Oh. Alright, gonna get a dash attack, and yeah, there you go. 3-0 victory from Meister. Moving on, the grand finals winner side here at Juicebox32. Mm-hmm. Yeah, even uh, even forfeiting us uh, the second stock at 11 percent, man, uh, it kind of gave Kirby Kid the small opening that he would need to try to make some sort of comeback. But Meister just too strong, man. Just not letting Kirby Kid have any breathing room whatsoever. So Meister gonna be sitting pretty and grand.